Hi there and welcome to the short video on having a look at order boundaries in more detail. What you actually see here on my US 30 order ticket is what's called the level 1 price. And whenever you try and execute a trade through CMC markets, we've got what's called automated execution. Which means that even in fast moving volatile markets, if you're trying to enter a trade, we'll always get you in at the, at the next available price, even if the market is moving at a fast pace. Now, for the majority of our clients, that's exactly the type of execution they want to go ahead and have. But depending on the type of strategy, it might be very, very specific for you to get in at a specific entry point. And that's really what boundaries gives you access to. It allows you to have greater control over your execution than ever before. So essentially, when I enable this in my order settings area, I'm just going to close this ticker right here and reopen it again. Now you'll notice that there is an extra icon which allows you to add a boundary. And essentially, if I try and place a trade right now at this price, that is my screen price. When it executes, that's my execution price. And what the boundary order does is allows you to stipulate that if the execution price is greater than 0.1 points away from my screen price, then reject the trade. I don't want to get into it. And that's essentially what boundary orders are for. In fact, I could even set that to be zero points if you want to be very, very specific about it. You want to get that exact screen price in relation to your execution price, that's exactly what I will go ahead and do for you. It's also possible for you to add this um, feature onto stop entry orders. So as you can see there, I've got my stop entry price right here and it works exactly the same way. So if I was to type in 0.1, that would mean that I am being very specific about uh, what execution I want relative to the screen price that's on there. <laughs> and you can see that any order that has a boundary attached to it, and this is in my pending order section right here, has a B to be indicative of the fact that I've got a boundary uh, placed on my trade, uh, which means that if the execution price is further than that boundary price away from the screen price, then it will not be executed. And that's how easy it is to go ahead and get set up with your boundary orders.